Adobe has released the latest version of Photoshop Elements, version 9. There's a new version for both Mac and PC users. In this video, we'll take a look at some of the exciting new features. First, there's a new interface. It's brighter, it's less cluttered, it uses a larger font size with more contrast, so it's easier to read. Bridge has been replaced by the organizer in the Mac version. Now Mac users can take advantage of some of the same features Windows users do, such as tagging images and the amazing people recognition feature. One of the major new features is layer masks. Now you can apply a layer mask to any layer in Elements, just like in the full version of Photoshop. That makes it a lot easier to do non-destructive editing. So now, for instance, I could duplicate my background layer. I can apply an effect like a Gaussian blur. So I'll go up to the filter menu, choose blur, Gaussian blur, and crank that up. Say OK. And now if I go down and click on this Add Layer Mask icon, it's the little circle inside a square, you can see I get a layer mask attached to that layer. So now all I have to do is choose my brush tool and make sure that my foreground color is set to black. Choose the right brush. I'm going to choose a soft brush. Make it a little bigger. Close that, make it a little bigger, and now just brush over the areas that I want the background to show through on. Or I can do something like this. I can let me duplicate this layer and then convert it to black and white, say OK, add a layer mask, and now all I have to do is paint with black, and the color from the layer below will come through. Make my brush a little smaller for around the edges here. and it really makes it convenient for doing these types of effects. Another amazing new feature, also borrowed from the full version of Photoshop, is Content Aware. In Elements, it's been added to the Spot Healing Brush. Let's take a look at that. Pull up this image. Okay, now let's say that we want to get rid of these people in the background of the image. I just choose the Spot Healing Brush. I go up to the Options bar and make sure Content Aware is checked. And size my brush so it's just a little bigger than the items I want to remove and then I just paint over them and they disappear and are filled in with background that matches the surrounding background and then if I want to take out like this dark item there with the right situation this is a great alternative to cloning the guided edit tab has a cool new category called fun edits there are five different fun edits. There's one called Out of Bounds, which lets you pop a portion of the photo out like this. And like this. This is what it looked like before. And this is it with the Out of Bounds feature. There's also a groovy one called Pop Art that gives you this Andy Warhol look. 
Also the Share tab has been updated. It's getting lots of buzz because it has a feature that lets you update your photos right to Facebook and Flickr and even optimizes them to the right specs for those sites. Photoshop Elements 9 is a major release with lots of amazing new features. I hope you found this video helpful. To see lots more information on Photoshop Elements, visit my website at EssentialPhotoshopElements.com. Until next time, take care.